discovered early on as a young boy that I loved to paint. I loved to draw. And, uh, and so that was sort of like my way to lose myself into my own little world. Wayne Gabilo is a self-taught street artist who performs in Waikiki. Art in motion, as he calls it, incorporates music, dancing, and audience participation to keep the crowd entertained. A key feature of his style is that it looks like a chaotic mess of flying paint, ripped up newspaper, and bottle caps. It looks like something any child could do, until the final product is revealed. Wayne and his brother started out in entertainment as a juggling act, but as a painter, he got his idea for a show while observing a bartender, flipping bottles while making drinks. Then right there the light bulb went up. Oh, maybe I should do a show while I'm painting. Wayne began performing in Kalakaua Avenue in Waikiki, but it wasn't a smooth journey. Ironically, it was his success at attracting a crowd that led him to almost stop painting and start looking for another line of work. Eventually, the crowds would get bigger and bigger and bigger. That affected me because of the police would shut down my show. I had to have a bodyguard watch so the crowd wouldn't get too big. And then eventually I did get get a citation for the police. That caused me to stop painting on Waikiki. A chance meeting with the chef from Tanaka of Tokyo took him to King's Village. The chef offered Wayne a job because he thought Wayne's juggling ability made him a good candidate to become a teppanyaki chef. But Wayne saw another opportunity to paint. A, an idea came in my head. But this looks like a nice place to paint. I wonder if I talk to the management they'll let me do my show here. Wayne was able to convince management to give him a shot at performing at King's Village. So they said, well, we can try you out for one week. And that's all I needed, a chance. That one week turned into months, then years. Today, Wayne has been at King's Village for the past 12 years and even has a gallery there. Wayne Gabilo believes that art can be anything that you have a passion for. Through his art, he hopes to inspire others to find their passions. This is Daniel Cam from Mid-Pacific Institute for Hikino. No.